What is going on guys, McRaptor here. We are back in Demon Souls Remake, this time doing a boss guide on the old hero. We're gonna show you an easy way to defeat old hero in the 4-2 area of Demon Souls. And we're also gonna show you an easy way to get back to the boss. There is no official shortcut, but this route we're gonna show you here in the event that you do die a few times to old hero, it is probably one of the most frustrating boss runbacks in the entire game of Demon Souls. To make things easier, make sure you hit up Grave Robber Blige and pick up several soul remains from him. They're pretty cheap, and they can be used to distract all these enemies here, like we see right here with these two gold skeletons and the silvers before. Very, very helpful on this run back. You don't need a lot. You just need enough just to get through the area. Probably five or six will be the most you need for a single run, but you might have to get back to Old Hero a few times, so make sure you have about a stack or so. Um, once you're in the cave area, you do have to take out this one enemy here, but that's okay. He's not too bad. He actually mainly does melee attacks. You can get, get by him. No trouble. Uh, drop another soul remain here if you can to distract Laser Boy and run on down here. Take him out or run by. The choice is, is yours. Keep running through the cave here. Um, again, if you've been through this area several times, you're very... Frustrated, just, you know, uh, take it one turn at a time. Make sure you have the soul remains on you and you'll be able to get through into the next area, which is still an annoying part of this run back. And yes, you are still running back to the boss. And I do not know why they did this in this game, but luckily soul remains are a thing. And this guide is a thing. And you're going to uh, watch this once or twice through and it's going to save you a lot of time so uh let us know in the comments too when we get to that point point. and don't forget we are actually going to show you how to kill the boss too so this is all just getting back to the boss which is oh my gosh like i don't know how many times i can say how frustrating this is drop another soul remains there to um distract the shadow lurker and there's also the reaper there which of course if you defeat the reaper it will uh, take out all the shadow Lurkers, which is great, but you're already past them. So why he's all the way over there? Just to be annoying. So you're going to run through this cave now and keep on going, going, going. We are getting closer and closer to our, our end goal. And again, we've already cleared all the items out here. So there are items you might want to pick up. So, that, so if this is your first time, you're probably going to want to explore a little bit. You're basically just going to stay up on this upper platform here. Do not follow the green. Do not jump into the pool. Do not do this. Oh, look at this little troll part. It looked like it was like a clear path to the exit, but it was not. It was a drop down. Thanks, Miyazaki. So you're going to run by all these slugs, um, which actually drop some really cool stuff that if you need to buff your weapon with a magic resin, you can actually farm these slugs here and get a ton of that sticky white buff consumable. All right. Now that you're past that, you're actually going to be able to go and fight old hero that was the most ridiculous run back ever but not too bad as long as you follow a good strategy so on old hero himself he's actually a fairly simple boss um just a few mechanics that you should know he is um very much blind although even though this is the demon souls remake here and they did improve some parts of the game his ai is still very glitchy and he will occasionally detect you out of nowhere and just run towards you and try to attack you. And it's very, very annoying, but um, beyond that glitch, you basically just don't run, attack him a couple times um, from his rear, and then kind of back out and wait for him to do one of his glitchy attacks. Again, if he runs straight at you, you're gonna have to dodge through it or block through his attacks. Just make sure that you don't sprint ever. So in the video here, we're going to show you a fairly easy way to beat him with a melee build. But if you want to beat old hero even easier, range builds work great. Again, he can still glitch out on you even when you're at range and come at you and attack you out of nowhere. Um, but he is fairly weak to magic. So go ahead and use that caster based build on him to great effect. You can also use a bow on him. Works fine. Doesn't do as much damage but uh works just fine on this guy again most of the time he won't be attacking you so if you're really far away the only thing that he could do is that glitch charge um also in the previous room with all of the slugs if you happen to take out any of those guys you probably have a ton of sticky white slime right now which you can use to buff your weapon and again that adds magic damage to your weapon so you can do that and just 
you know, very easily get some very solid damage. So here's kind of the glitch attack, and he did it twice. So we were at, like, super far range. There's no way he saw us or heard us. Like, he's blind. We weren't running. We were just sitting there. So if you stay at range like that, he will eventually find you, and you'll have to kind of reset the fight. And so he did it again, so you have to be very careful at range. And in some ways, it's actually a lot easier just to take him out with a melee build, but I did want to show you guys the different options that you can do. They're really quite simple. You just have to um, don't get greedy. Um, either take them out with range or in melee, but make sure if you can to bring in something to, that does either magic damage or he's also supposed to be fairly weak to poison. Uh, never tried poison on him myself, but uh, he's not very resistant, so you can give, give that a shot as well if you just want to poison him and sit back and watch him uh, just lose his health. So that's pretty much it for the guide. I hope it was helpful, uh, especially just getting back to the boss. That's like a bigger deal than actually fighting old hero himself. So hope you guys are having a good time in Demon Souls remake. Uh, make sure to check out ggsouls.com for a ton of guides on Soulsborne games like Demon Souls, Dark Souls, Bloodborne, and Sekiro. Uh, we'll have more updates and guides and news and information uh, posted every single week. So make sure you check out ggsouls.com and don't forget to like and subscribe. I will see you guys on the next one.